What's up guys? We are back here with another Everything's Regular Copart video. Man, we are back. We are down south somewhere, man, in the boonies, man. Got another Mozzie here, 2015 Maserati. Now you guys seen the other one on the rims. Me personally, I prefer this one without the rims only because it'll be easier to uh, resell. People don't really want these type of cars on rims. Uh, but this one actually has way more damage than the other one just by this airbag being out. See, that's crazy. Maybe let's check out the other side really quick to see where the damage is. Cause it looked like the damage might have been on that door right there. But it really doesn't look like that could have been hit now. I don't know. But you guys tell me. This, the airbags is out of this thing. For what reason? I don't really see any like real damage though i don't know that's kind of weird what do you guys think uh what do you guys think happened here man Seventy-two thousand miles on a maserati top of the airbags is gone i don't know i don't really even see any damage dog what y'all think man let me know in the comments below all righty we got a tesla 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 got a 2020 tesla now, why is it here? Looks like it got hit under here. Oh, damn. It says replace latch, emissions locked, clips, get light emblem. I don't really see any real damage on this thing. It's a 2020 Tesla. Okay, did the door open by itself? Okay. Never even been in a Tesla before, but you guys see it looks like the airbags and stuff is out in the back or something. They took off these casings. I don't know if they're blown, but um, pretty simple and plain in here. Like it really, uh, it's really not much of nothing. Never even been in the inside of one of these before, but this one is a 2020. Don't see any real damage, but the damage that I do see, it's not that bad at all, so. You guys let me know what y'all think, man. We got a little Porsche Cayman. This thing is a 2011. Like they smell. Oh, they got a whole racing set up in here. They got racing seats and all type of stuff. Airbag is blown up front. But uh, they got some nice seats in there. On some little race wheels or whatever. A little Porsche Cayman. They got the X in the back real race car roll uh, cage stuff this one actually might be faster than your normal uh cayman i'm sure because one nobody put a roll cage in there if this thing is stock but i don't know your guess is as good as mine of course the trunk i believe is in the front here but uh 85 000 miles on it we got a 2014 bentley flying spur here nice little navy blue in color Damn, they didn't whoop the Bentley, man. Damn, man. How you whoop the Bentley, though? 2014 does start. Um, it looks like the suspension is pretty much uh, giving out W12, whatever that means. We take a quick look at the inside, man. Oil and grease hands. Whatever mechanic had this, man, they was just like, hey, man, I ain't tripping. You want me to fix it, right? But literally, the bumper's in the car. Nothing too spectacular. It looks just like all the other uh, Bentleys way before. Like a 2008, the interior has not changed. Um, we can open this back door up. Really spacious. I didn't know you had all these. Uh, You got all these little controls down here, which is cool. That's nice. Reminds me of the Maybach a little bit. But I think I still think the Maybach might be a little bit nicer than the, this Bentley for sure. But um, I'm digging it, man. What y'all think about it? I like the Bentley, man. It should go for a cool little price. Cool little price compared to retail, man. And it still starts, man. What y'all think about the Bentley, man? Let your boy know in the comments below, dog. Got a nice little 19 Ram here, man. But it's looking like it's leaning like a cholo, man. This thing's sitting sideways. You ain't got no rim. God, Lee, where the wheels go? Where the wheel go, man? All right, so you're going to need a wheel for up here. Um, and some most suspension parts. I don't know where that stuff went. 
And this suspension look all the way jacked up in the back. This thing is just all whooped. This is what you're gonna need. I guess you got all your supplies here so you can just take off what you may be still able to salvage off of that. But this 19 is done for right now. Done for now, but hey. The interior though, look at the interior. It's got like snake skin, wood grain, chocolate brown seats. I actually really like this truck. That's why I like coming to Copar. You see literally all the new trucks that's out and you can check out the interior like this screen is literally killing the raptor now that's would be one reason i would uh trade in my raptor just to get something newer like i do have a 17 but man it's 2021 man so got to keep that in mind dang this thing got flat they for sure didn't live yeah that's a wrap that's crazy wow yeah, that looked like it hurt. I'm good. I want no parts. Man, y'all know we got to keep an eye out for the diamonds in the rough, man. And uh, these G8 GTs literally right now are like skyrocketing in a uh, resale. <laughs> uh, only because like people usually take the little 6.0 out of them and throw the 6.2 in them. Then you're good to go. This one, uh, you're going to need two new doors. I'm sure the airbags is broken or airbags is broken airbags is blown it's a 09 it does have the 6.0 engine i believe this one thing this thing has about ninety five thousand miles or something like that uh it looks like they got some type of aftermarket exhaust on here for show definitely got aftermarket exhaust definitely got bmr suspension all that good stuff brembo brakes on it like i said guys diamond in the rough <sighs> diamond in the rough okay we got some broken glass okay broken glass from that side but literally red and black interior really good looking g8 gt man um wish we can start this thing up and hear it purge but i don't think it's gonna be that doable but we can try and see oh man i dropped the key man Man, I was trying to crank it up to hear this joint. I see you got the Cadillac wheels on it. Oh yeah, this thing is this thing got exhaust and everything. Let me see. This model, no, but I know which one you're talking about. <laughs> told you. <laughs> I told you it had some exhaust. Yes, sir. Y'all hear? It. Oh, and it got a cam. It sounds like he got a cam and exhaust and everything. That's crazy. Okay, I'm digging it. Woo. Woo. Oh my God. Yeah, this thing barking. They better shut that shit off before they come kick us off this motherfucker. Yeah, that for sure got a cam, exhaust, full built motor, everything. I told y'all this was the diamond in the rough. This is the stuff you gotta look out for, man. Now these doors over here might be whooped, but literally with that motor and everything, man, pop this hood on this joint, man. Let's see what we got up in here, man. It's, I, t I just knew it was like exhaust and cam and all that shit. All right, so we got an LS2, we got headers. Uh, I can't really see what style headers them is. They might be Cook's headers. Mm -hmm, got the MSD plugs on it. Yeah, he got some serious little shit up in here. Definitely got a cam, got the is little intake. Yeah, he got a catch can right there. That's what I'm saying. This one is fully built. It's fully built. He definitely, yeah, this is definitely a race car. Oh, yeah, you can see better on so, man, we're going to have to keep this one for ourselves, man. I might have to post this video later, man. But, yeah, this is definitely the joint, man. I like this one. Out of all the ones I've seen here today, this yeah, for sure the one. They got a Z06. Uh, they got a, this is to work, but they got a Z06. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh yeah, I might, I might have to, I might have to check that out, man. We got a Raptor over here. I'm digging this one. This is definitely not the Raptor like ours, but it's definitely a nice looking Raptor. This one got the 6.2 in it, 6.2 liter V8 Raptor. Um, oh wow, yeah, they had some uh, unfortunate events happen through their suspension and stuff off. That sucks, man. They're going to help need a whole new little... It actually can be fixed. It's not that bad, but... Definitely going to need some love shown to it. 
I got that little cover on mine too. Yeah, I, I love these little, uh, these Raptors, man. The first person I seen with one of these was Bankroll Fresh. And ever since I seen one of, one of those, he had like a white one. I was like, oh yeah, I gotta get one now. This one, literally uh, nothing compared to mine. The, actually, the seats do look pretty good. I'll give it that. The seats do look really good. 105,000 miles, black leather interior. Like I said, really decent. Um, it doesn't have the panoramic roof, but it does have a sunroof. The controls and up everything up here look exactly the same as my truck. That's what sucks. You spend all that money to get the same exact stuff, just a little facelift. But what can I say? It's a 6.2, man. I'm digging it. What y'all think about it, man? Let me know in the comments below. So, alrighty, guys, it's gonna be a wrap for today's video, man. If you haven't already, please like, comment, and subscribe, man. We out here on the other side of the coast with my dog, Big Play Ray, man. We out here in the boonies right now, checking out some rides and some bikes, man. Seeing what we can score and check out and win for the low, man. I'm looking for another bike. Always looking for bikes. Always looking for cheap trucks and stuff like that. So, you never know what we might be able to find, man. We are out here in the boonies though man so if you guys haven't already man please like comment and subscribe man i'll have to catch you guys on the next one man peace